All right, good morning and welcome to Daf Yomi, just Daf it, I like to call it. Uh, Mesechaz Yevamos, Daf Laman Aleph 31. We have a wonderful shear for you today, and it was very difficult to prepare this shear, especially the Ion of Ben Sion portion, which really, I mean, if you don't ever watch Ion Shiurim, uh, this is the one to start with um, and end with if you don't want to watch it anymore. Because we're talking about major fundamentals in Lumdus. Uh, every person in Yeshiva, whoever has gone to Yeshiva in your life, I don't think you'll ever hear an Ian share like this. And touches on fundamental topics like Suffolk the Raisa, Chumra, Suffolk the Rabban and the Kula, Kiddushin, what makes a Kiddushin, what makes a Gerishin, what makes a Mecher, Edim, Shtekit Edim, Karachachal Edim, all. The, the stuff they call it raid in yeshivas. Raid means set over it's stuff, and also raid in English means you raid, meaning you raid the kitchen. Let's say, you know, if if Torah is compared to food, you'll raid the kitchen. You'll take everything uh, from the kitchen and eat it because it's a midnight snack and you're very hungry. This is what this like, this year is like. You're especially extremely hungry. You raid the kitchen, you can eat whatever you want. Of course, it's an expensive kitchen with good expensive food. Um, you'll enjoy it, and I said to my friend over here, I said, listen, if Rav Gershon Edelstein, who was probably the, Ru- the Rosh Hashiva now that Rav Chaim Kanevsky has passed on, uh, he was giving this shir, it would go viral, it would be an Ian shir that would go viral, even though it would be in Hebrew, and it would be in Panovich, it would go viral, an Ian shir going viral, I mean, millions of people would watch it, but because it's just me, simple Ben Sion Lang saying this shir, it's not going to go viral, that's just... The world that we live in, unfortunately, today, uh, we're biased against people that are not gedola. It's not fair, but this is the world we live in today. But one day, maybe they'll be a gadol, and the video will still be on YouTube, and you can still check it out, because Torah never becomes old. As they say on YouTube, evergreens, there's videos called evergreens. They always are good. Torah is not changing, it's not going anywhere, so it'll always be there on YouTube. And you'll enjoy it. But today's daf, we're going to talk about some of those topics that I talked about today. How it relates to the Mishnah on Laman Amad Bez. We'll start the Mishnah on Laman Amad Bez. We talked about yesterday. <clears throat> if there's a Gerashin or Kedushin Safik, again, this is involving our extremely complex case of Gibum. In the first case in the Mishnah, where someone is married to a woman, a co wife, and he's married to an erva, not an erva to him, but an erva to his brother like his brother's daughter, or you're allowed to marry your niece, you're married to your brother's daughter, let's say that's the case, and there's a sorry, you're married to a co-wife, and now, the mission introduces that there's a suffix, there's questionable whether you're actually a kiddushin, whether you're actually the, the first brother who's, who's going to end up dying, actually with Makadish, the erva of the second brother, the, the daughter, or if he was married, the suffix, whether he's Magarish, or what's the practical math? I mean, meaning if he's... Makadisher, we learn the halacha on the top base, if he's Makadisher. So then, she, the, she's an erva, he's married to an erva. And the, the co-wife is Sarah's erva. And when he dies, and he falls with his brothers, that means his brother is now in a Zika Sibam with an erva and a Sarah's erva. He's potter, both the erva and the Sarah's erva, potter, and the Yibam, to Mutaris or Shuk, nothing is needed to be done. Savi Gerishin would be, where a case where we know for sure she's been married, he's married to the erva, the first brother. And there's a suffix whether he got divorced from her. Like the, the mission says in some cases, right, where it was written in the Ksav Yad, it was written in his own hands without aid or one aid or no zman. Suffolk Gerish and the Gemara is going to add another case uh, on Lamina, Lamina on Daf 31b. Uh, in these cases, Suffolk Gerish, we're not sure if there was a divorce. Because if she's divorced, right, like the Mishnah says on Beis Amad Beis, uh, in our Masechta, that if she's divorced, the Erev is divorced before the before he dies, before the brother dies, so then he was no longer married to the Erev of Bishas Misa. We hold, if he's not married to Bishas Misa, so then she's a Sarah of nobody. She's not a co-wife, and therefore she's in a Zika's Yibum, and she's Asura Lashuk, she'd be Asura to marry somebody else. She needs either a Chalitza or a Yibum from the brother, the said the brother who remains living. So now the Gemara, we'll just go back to the Gemara just to have a flow. The Gemara starts, V'ilu, V'gerish, and Safek, Karavlo, Safek, Karavlo, Lo, Kasani. 
uh, by Gerishin, it doesn't say, <coughs> we're not sure, uh, it doesn't say the case, it says Kiddushin, the case of Suffolk Kiddushin is where he threw a Kiddushin, he threw money to her, and was that a small Amos, to four Amos, uh, four, eight Amos between the two, the man and the woman, and he threw it exactly in the mid midpoint, we're not sure, we can't figure out, it was close to him or close to her, right, Dalit Amos, or Kona, uh, in uh, Rosh Hashanah, but in the Rabban, the Gemara says in Bab Metziah, it's Kona. So therefore, if it's Karov Law, it would be a Kedusha. If it's Karov Law, it wouldn't be a Kedusha. We're not sure it's close to. So it only says about Kedusha, Magerish doesn't say it. We're going to have to answer this question. This is the question we're dealing with today. Why Magerish doesn't say it? Spoiler, the Gemara will relent at the end and say it, it, it is included in Gerish. It doesn't say it. Karzagar uh, Lo Kasani, my timer. Why is that? I'm a Rabba. Isha Zuba Cheskas Hatel Medes. In the case of Gerishin, Right, she has a chazaka that, right, she once he's she's married, she's an Arab, she's married to the brother, so therefore, she regarding the second brother, uh, he's she's already married, so it's his daughter is going to be an Arab, so therefore, she's an Arab, the co wife's an Arab, so the head of the shuk, you don't give him a khalid. So, misafik daba ozra, you want to ask her on the shuk, I'll tell her misafik, therefore, you shouldn't ask her misafik. The mission says in all these cases, you need khalidza. You need chalitza and not yibum. Why do you have to ask her? You don't even need chalitza. I'm really Abaye. Abaye said to me, "Yachim kedusha nami name each of the bchas kaseh to liyavum medes." Where is the suffix where they actually erva was married to the brother? The boss was married to the first brother, right? So she, the sara, is considered mutter to the yavum, right? Because we don't assume the suffix whether she's mikdash or not. Misavik da bala osra. Why do you ask her the yavum? Let her do yibum. Why do you need chalitza? Then where's house in the chumer there? By Kiddushan, we say L'chumra, you're right, it's Suffolk. But L'chumra, we go L'chumra, we say New Chalitza. So the Gemara says, Hai das de kulahu. It's a Chumra, which is eventually going to come to being lax in Halach. But Zim, the Azil, who? Makadish la Lacho. So what happens? Maybe he'll go back and he'll Makadish her sister. He wasn't sure he's Makadish the daughter, right? And then he'll Makadish the sister of the daughter. Kiddushan Vada, Vinami. Alternatively, Zim, the Asa Acher. He was suffering with Makadish, this daughter of the, the, the second of the brother who's waiting, who's going to be the, the Yavam. Um, and someone else, a third person is Makadish. Kedusha Vade, Vade Kedusha. And came with the Asher Lamar, the Sara, the And since we asked the Sara to do Yibum, right, we said you should just do Chalis and not Yibum, Amri, the Kama Kedushin, the Basra Lav Kedushin. They're going to say it must be. That the first one was a kedusha, right? It must be she, the first guy, the first brother was married to the Arab. Uh, the boss of kedusha, and the second one, like you can't make a woman twice. She's been to one man, she can't to the second man. So, therefore, and what's going to happen? And then what's going to happen is that we're not going to require a get from the second husband, even though it's a kedusha, Suffolk, and really she didn't mean Suffolk, she needed a get from the second husband. Where it says Kavan, top of Lamad Aleph Manal, Kavan, the Kamatrach and the Khalitza, no, that would only be if we didn't need Khalitza. But since the mission says you need Khalitza, made the Yadiyah, the Khumra Ba'amhu, we'll know that the Khalitza is only made in Khumra. So the Gemara says, Yahaki Gerish and Ami, listen to the Evolution of Khalitza. By Gerish, and also, let's say, let her do a Khalitza. Well, made the Yadiyah, the Khumra Ba'amhu. Right? Why do we say, the mission says, Right? Why don't we include that case of Gerishin where Suffolk Kar of Law, Suffolk Kar of Law? Right? And let him do a Chalitza and do a Chalitza. And people will know and they won't come to make a mistake. Immediately, the Chumra Ba'amahu. Where it says, we don't want to institute a Chumra Chalitza because then if a person knows his Chalitza and they know obviously Chalitza is only done in a situation where there's an opportunity to yibum, so they're going to come next time in that situation to yibum, which is a problem. Because even could be a problem. The rice is the most hakanami. You might tell me about chalitz. It's a benefit. By kedushin, also, if you might, if you need, if you necessitate chalitza, meet lechomra, she's going to come to yibum. The Gemara says this yab im got klum. Chazaka kaima. The Gemara says me the rice doesn't make a difference. Even if she does yibum in the case of safek kedushin, right? Let the sara do yibum to the brother. Im the kach klum, and there's no problem. Chazaka kaima because me the rice. This is a, a suffix we're going to see. It's a suffix you see us. Hey, Shmuel, how you doing? Ah. Welcome, Shmuel. We're in the middle of a tough sugi over here. When you're learning a tough sugi in the Gemara, like, like what do you do? Like, do you pull out your the beard, the hairs of your beard? 
Like, how many hairs do your beard do fall out? You know, how, first of all, how many hairs do you have in your beard? Have you counted ever? No. You should treasure every hair in your beard and count them, you know? Just treasure it, you know? Just write it down in a book because, you know, on a day where you get another hair, you can write let's that hope, down. Yeah, let's hope the hair, yeah, the whole hair is growing, you know what I'm saying? Here today, gone tomorrow, you know what they say. So if you lose a hair, like let's say of an accident, like like you pass by a tree and it gets stuck on a tree, on a branch, and you lose a hair, do you cry? Maybe if it hurts, I'll go make a little, make a little noise. So you're not growing your beard out of uh, humra, meaning you're not you're not. You just happen to have a beard. You feel like it looks better like that, right? Like yeah. you're not you're not doing it for a halachic reason, right? Like, no, if I no, asked no. you, would, you know, I could shave your beard, like, you tell me, okay, no problem, right? I don't know. I don't have to. No? How much money would it take for me to be able to shave your beard on camera in front of my audience? Okay, let's go back to the CD now. <laughs> How much money would you would you take? Relevant, would you let me do it for free? What? To shave your beard. Oh, no, no, no. Because look at me. I, I started shaving. I used to have a little beard, but now I shave. Of course, it's going to be severe when I can't shave, but... Uh, I'm gonna look like you, Shmuel. I'm gonna look worse than you. Not worse than you. This is not worse than you. I was gonna be more of a beer than you. Who? Me. During ah, Svira. Oh, good, good, good. That's a good idea. I have a beard. Why not? Beards are in. You know, I saw one of these big guys in the head. Big company man, president of the company. He has a big beard. What's that? You know, oh, right? Dorsey, Jack Dorsey. Oh, yeah, Jack Dorsey. I saw a picture. And you heard what happened. I mean, now Elon Musk bought a. Uh, the, he has the biggest shareholder in Twitter now, nine percent stake. Wow, Elon Musk. Wow, big news. Because he wants to preserve uh, free speech. He thinks uh, Twitter doesn't provide a form of free speech. What is he? Are you familiar with this? I have no idea, but what is he? Did you see Elon Musk's beard? Elon Musk. <laughs> in <laughs> fact, in fact, when in part of the inclusion when he bought the nine percent stake. He asked, he asked Jack Dorsey to, to shave off his beard and give him his beard and glue it on to him. So Elon Musk. <laughs> okay, I'm joking. I'm joking. joking. I can't wait to listen to the sheer. Who has a better beard, Jack Dorsey or James Harden? Yeah, this, the same beard, you, that's, that's the answer, right? You know who James Harden is? I don't know who he is, no. Okay, let's learn. I, 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 <laughs> All right, we're going to learn. You came to learn. All right, good. At least from all here to support my learning. Okay, so now we're back to the Gemara. So the Gemara says, "Velish chachalitza made the idea the chumra ba'almo." The Gemara says, "Tamar chalitza means b'hachanami." 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 Right? Unfortunate happened. He's married to his niece. You marry your niece. And you're married to another woman. He has two wives. And you know what? A tornado comes. Knocks down the entire house. There's no survivors. We don't know who died first. Now, this is significant. Why? Because it's Bas Achiv. Now, his, he didn't have any children from this lady. And Bas Achiv is what happens to be the daughter of his brother. Now he you know, he has a brother who was waiting Yibam. He wasn't in the house, so we don't know the Sara wasn't in the house. The co-wife she wasn't in the house, right? If the the husband died first, right? If the husband died first, so then uh, it's probably it's it's this, it's this situation where we have a Sara's erva because the erva, but if. She, if she died first, then, right, like the Mishra says in Beis, and Beis, Meizun is Garsha. If she died first, there's no Saras Erva. And therefore, the Sar will be mutter to the Achib. And if she, if he died first, then the Sar will be also be Saras Erva, it's the daughter of the brother. So we don't know what to do. Chaletz, Saras, Chaletz, Nimit, Safik, Midorai, Chaletz, Nimit, we don't, we do Chaletz, not you. Am I? Hachanami, Nema, Ishizu, Bechaz, Kesed, Alashuk, Omedes. We say here also, he's Vade married her, right? So, Hed, Alashuk, Omedes. She's, uh, she, the Sara, is a Chazaka, she's mother, because she, he, she's really, technically, right now, she's a Sara, Sara, before the tornado happened. Don't answer her. Maybe you'll tell me over there, you're If you do Chalitza, if people see you do Chalitza, they'll come to the Yibam, you move to the Raisa. Where it says, Gershon, the Shchichi, Gazru, Baraban, Gershon, which is Shchiach, 
So Rabbanan were gozer. Apolis, the Loshchichi, the Logazer, Rabbanan. Apolis, the Loshchichi, is not Shchiach. So therefore, the Rabbanan were in gozer. One second. Inam Gerish in the Kaima Erva, the Kamuchach. The Sarasa, Kamatrach, and Halisa, Amri Kamu Verabana, Begita, the Gita Mali, who Asu Lia Bume, the Tsara. By Gerish, we have to be more careful. By Gerish, we have to be more careful because the Erva is still alive. The Erva is still alive. And we see it, people see the Erva is still alive. And the Tsara were doing Khalitsa. So people will think that Rabana understood what's going on right here. They know that it was a good get. Uh, ask the Bumi Lasara, and therefore, uh, they, they knew it was a good get, and since they knew it was a good get, so therefore, they let her do Yibum. Uh, my polis, me come with Rabbanim, my polis, uh, by my polis, no one can say for certainty that the Rabbanim knew, they have no idea, no one can know who died first in the tornado. So, therefore, they say do Chalitza as opposed to the case of. Safi Karol, Safi Karol Gerish, and we don't say Chalitza, because then we say Yimatam or Chalitza and Misya Bemis. So the Gemara says Milos Nan. We have a Gerish and Milos Nan, but the Gerish we have a case. That's not High Soul Medes, which is Ram Zark Lo Karov Lo Migreshes Karov Lo Migreshes. Okay, so you throw the the man throws the get to his wife. It's Safi whether it's within the four Amos of her or four Amos of him. Mechsal Mechsa Migreshes. It's exactly halfway between them. She's Migreshes and Migreshes. It's basically another way of saying a Safi. I mean, you know. So what does it mean? Migoresh is Migoresh. The Kohen who asurale. If the husband is a Kohen, so she's Asur because it's, maybe she's Migoresh. And therefore, Garush is Asur to a Kohen. If this woman who is Megarish is an Erva, so therefore the Sora needs Chalitza, right? Because maybe it was a good Gerish. And if it's a good Gerish, so then technically you could do Yivam to the, to the Sora. But if it's not a good Gerish, or Right, or Masuk is not a good Gerish, and then it would be, it would be a Saras Arab, but he wouldn't be allowed to do out Yibam, so therefore you do Chalitza. Here, by, by Gerish, we don't say if you do Chalitza and come to do Yibam. Why don't we say that over here? We just said by Gerish, we would say we don't, we don't, uh, we don't allow Chalitza because we come to do Yibam. So the Gemara tries to answer this. In the case of Safik Karavala, Safik by Gerish is a unique case where it's not that. One group of Adim, this is what the Gemara understands originally. One group of Adim watches a garrison, right? You need two Adim to affect the garrison, right? And it's seen as garrison. So therefore, oh, right. they they see it. Rabbi, what's his name? Hi, it's how are you? Photographer? You want to take pictures of me? Put them on Instagram? <laughs> All right, he didn't like that joke. I don't even know what Instagram is. Uh, <laughs> Instagram. All right. Anyway, you sent somebody far away that you're coming. No, it's Telegram. All right. Um, anyway, so um, it's a unique case. It's One unique kind case. of Adam sees the what, Gerish. Why is it unique? No, because it, not a unique case. The, the normal case of Safi Karla, Safi Karla is two Adam are watching the Gerish, and, and they can't figure out who is it close to or not. They don't have a right. measuring tape, That's so they can't figure they it out. Figure so it out. this case is talking about a case where there's actually two Kidaidim, and they actually say separate things. Not that they're not sure. One says it was Kar of Law, and someone says it's Kar of Law. Why is that different? To have at least Sveika Dal Raisa. That's a Sveika Dal Raisa, because normally what I'm totally talking about, when it's Suffolk and Metzias, we don't know. So when we don't know, that's a weak Suffolk. It's a weak Suffolk. And Midal Raisa, this, listen to this. This is a Kiddush, I'm telling you. This is part of Ima Ben Zion. When we have a suffix in Metzias, how do you how do you, how do you decide where, where do we go? We don't know what to do, yeah. right? So we paskin in that case, right? Koach de teira adif, right? Koach de teira adif, right? We paskin, we go ahead there and suffix midoray says lakula. I'm telling you this right now. So midoray says not lachomer. Oh, and he says shteki te edim. Really? Shteki te edim. Yeah, we say lachomer. I'm explaining you only where it establishes. Two, two edus. One one aid says car of law, one says car of law. That's a real stira. 50 50 stira. That's a 50 series stira. We go to Chumra. That's exactly so cost of the Torah tells you to go to Chumra. But if it's not, so the Gemara says if it's a suffix in Metzias, so therefore Midaraisa we go to Kula, Midarabana, you go to Chumra. 
Actually, Midoraisa, we actually establish if there's a Chazaku, we go with the Chazaku. We go with the pre, the, the status quo. We go with the status quo. If there's no status quo, then we'd go with the Kula. So if there's a status quo, so um, the Havali Sveka, the Rav Mana. Uh, here we're talking our Mishnah, it's uh Masizan Haka about Kasaka to Havali Sveka the Rabbana. Our Mishnah is talking about one Kadabi, one set of it, and then Savik Mitsias. Uh which is Savik the Rabbana. And Savik the Rabbana. And Rice the Gola Kula. And Savik the Rabbana, so therefore uh we go with the Khazaka and we establish it based on the Khazaka. My demand is the Haka Kasaka. How do you know we're talking about our Mishnah is talking about Kazaka? Do me the Kedushin. Because any case of Gerushin is similar to, to Kedushin. Not Kedushin, Kasachas, Ab Gerushin, Kazakh. Just like the case of Kedushin, Karavla, Karavla, and our Mishnah is one cat. So too, Gerushin, Kazachas. <clears throat> now, Rashi is a funny thing where he says, Kazachas by Kedushin, he says, it's not that two Adim sword, and they're not sure, both of them are not sure which Karavla, Karavla. It's that one says Karavla, and one says Karavla. And the Rishon of Ask on this Rashi, they say, how is it possible, Rashi, to say this? We know that Kol Darvish Be'erva and Pachos. Uh, Mishnayim, you need Shtayim. So how could, if one says, Karola, Karola, the Gemara says in Kedushan, on Dafsam, I believe, the Gemara's Maskana is that, Eid Echa, Leis Bey Kulum, it's not worth anything. So how could Rashi say over here, that Eid Echa, means one Eid's Karola, Karola, we'll get back to that in Yom Ben Zion. Um, so the Gemara says, Maybe Kedushan is actually talking about it can't be. <sighs> This Yabim Kachlum. There's no problem by Kiddushin of doing Yibam. Let her do Yibam. Uh, let the Sar do Yibam. There's no problem. Kami Adam Kamri Karavlava. Ata Amrat Tis Yabim. Adam Kachlum. The Gemara asks on this, what are you talking about? Um, there's two Adam that say that it was Karavla, meaning it was Gun Kiddushin. How could the Sar do Yibam? It would be a Sar's Erva. Sarfak Dal Raik said, Vesu Shtiki Ti Adam, Nami Sveki the Rabbanani. The Mar says it can't be talking about two key to either my kedusha because it's fake of the rabbanon he the amri oki trail of a hadi trail of isha okma chazaka. Now the art scroll I think makes a blunder over here. I can say that the art makes a blunder. They say this question over here, the su. They say I'll read the art scroll's words over here. The su. Uh, here this introduction over here, having demonstrated the untenability of the foregoing answer, the Gemara goes back to the question, the very basis of that answer, which is a principle chazak cannot be applied biblically in a case which two sets of witnesses oppose each other. They say the Gemara is chozerbo, and the Gemara says no. Even when you have trei vitrei, two items say bevade one, two items say bevade the other. The Gemara says it's really a weak suffix, and you go with the chazaka. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to explain to you, and see, and that's not what the Gemara is saying here. The Gemara is just challenging by kedushin. Because the Gemara makes a fundamental distinction between Gedushin and Gerushin, the Eden, my Kedushin and Gerushin. Get back to the Yigav Sion. So the Gemara is saying, Vesu, and furthermore, Shteki, the Eden, Nami, Sveki, the Rabbani, my Kedushin is only so the Rabbani. I'm ready, Oki, Trey, Vadi, Trey, Vi, Ukmei, Yachazaka. Me, the, how do you know by Kedushin, even if it's Trey, Vitrey, you'd still say it's Suffolk, the Raisa, Lakula, Suffolk, the Rabbani, Lachomra. Me, the, how do you know by Shatya, when it comes to Mecher? When we're selling property, we don't know. This guy is lucid or he's not lucid. He's deranged or he's not deranged. He's a guy that, I don't know, has paranoia. He gets psychotic sometimes. If you're in a state of, a, if you're in a sickle, sick, uh, schizophrenia, whatever, uh, and you're selling land, it's not a valid sale, right? Anixi Barshati, the Barshati is of Anixi. He sold a property. Asu Betrev, Amri Kashu Chalim's up. And two Adam said, no, he was lucid when he was doing that. Asu Betrev, Amri Kashu Shota's up. Others said, no, he was a Shota. He was psychotic when he sold. Amri Rashi, Ukashel, Bahadi Tre. We take two against two. Va'ara, Ukma, Chazaka. It's a weak suffix. Therefore, you go with the Chazaka. And we give the land to Barshatia. We keep it where it was. So Kiddushin like Erushin. So must be talking about one kind of aid. So, El Amar Abaye. So, the Gemara says, El Amar Abaye, Abaye. The Gemara fell off Raba. The Gemara didn't fall off Raba. And that will answer Tosa's question, the bottom Tosa's on Lam and Aleph and Aleph. That will answer Elam and Sion based on what I just said. El Amar Abaye, Yagidol of Reu, Sintana. Why didn't the, 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 that was the original question. Why didn't the Mishnah by Gerish and also Kar say Karavlo, Karavlo? Yagidol of Reu, Tanam Kedushin, who had the Gerish, Tanam Kedushin, who had the Kedushin. Yeah, it is included in the Mishnah. It said some case by Kedushin. And whatever it said by Kedushin would apply to Gerish. And in that case by Gerish, it would apply to Kedushin. I'm like, Rava, Yagidol of Reu, my Zehu de Kasani. If it's Yagidol of Reu, that each apply in whatever case by Kedushin apply by Gerish. And whatever case by Gerish apply by Kedushin, why did it say Zehu? Zehu, it says by Zehu by Kedushin. It says Zehu by Gerish. And these words are the Mishnah. 
Zeu Safik Yedushin. And then it says the case of Safik Yedushin. Zeu Safik Yedushin. Zeu comes to exclude only by Yedushin, only by Kedushin, it seems. Ela Amarava, Kosh Yedush by Kedushin, Yedush by Yedushin. No. Whatever it says by Kedushin, it applies by Yedushin also. So by Kedushin, the case of Safik Karla, Safik Karla, would, would apply by Yedushin, like the Mara wanted to say. But the case of Gerishin, there is a case of Gerishin that wouldn't apply by Kedushin. Therefore, it says by Zehu, by Kedushin is to exclude something, which is that it wouldn't apply by Kedushin. And Zehu, the word Zehu by Gerishin is Lav Davka, because it would include a case of Karvla Karvla. I'm assuming the Tana Zehu by Kedushin, because there was a reason to say Zehu by Kedushin, Tana Nami Zehu by Gerishin. Therefore, it says the word Zehu by Gerishin. The Gemara asks, Zehu by Kedushin, the Mute Ma, what is it coming to exclude? The Mute is Man. To exclude the case of Zman, right? Where you write a star Kedushin, but you don't write a time on it. The lake of a Kedushin, that's not a sign of a Kedushin. It's a valid Kedushin, even if you write the Zman and the Kedushin. Why wouldn't the Rabbanan are careful to establish a time in Kedushin? It's a machlok in Mizrach's Gitin, why they're masakin to write a Zman. So it's my, one opinion says the reason is because of Piri. That the Nixay Mulug, one of the properties that the husband gets when he marries a woman, is called Nixay Mulug. He gets her land or property, and he gets to eat the fruits. The land remains in her rishos, but he gets to eat the fruits. So therefore, if there's no if there's no time in the get, uh, he'll cl- he'll start eating the fruits after the gerish really happened, and he'll claim the gerish happened later. So they were masakin his man, so he should she don't lose any money. So therefore, kedushin arusa lays lay pire. So it makes sense by kedushin. There's no reason his man because all kedushin affects the state of erusin, and he doesn't get payros by kedushin, only by, uh, only by nisuin. El mother mishum was basacho. So the one who says the reason you're masakin his man by get is because to cover up for. Let's say he's married to his niece, right? And she's family. So, and she was Mazana. She went and committed adultery. They should mishak it in Zaman by Kedushin also, right? To make sure they shouldn't be able to cover up for his his niece, right? By Gerishin, if they don't write the date, so therefore she'll come to Mazana while she was still married to him. And he'll write the get that was earlier than they got divorced earlier when it really wasn't true. And by Kedushin also. She was Mazan, he was Makadisha, and then she was Mazana after the Kiddush, and he'll write that the Kiddush happened later on, and I'll save her. So the Gemara says, Why didn't you write it by Kiddush? And the Gemara says, the the Makadish, the Shtara, the Ikan Rabban, and Zman. It's not exclusive that you have to Makadish with a Shtar. By Gitan, by, by get, you can only Makadish with a Shtar, you can't Makadish with Kesef. By Kiddush, you can Makadish with Kesef. I'm like, Ravach, Bered Rabbi Yosef Ravash, Ha Avda, the Ika, the Kani, the Kasik, the Kari, the Shtara. When you're not calling an Evid, Kanani, you can be kona her and never kanani with kasa for star. We take a rabbanon zman there. They're on a worm asaka in zman, like it says in mizrachas get. And the gemara says hasam ruba b'shtar or hakar ruba b'kaspa. There by avadim, most avadim you're kona them with shtaros. They write shtaros to record the matter. By kedushin, most people give a ring. They give something shabbat kasa worth kasa. That's therefore they didn't feel a need to masaka for the miut. Ibai say I'm shun the lefshar. Alternatively, they make Zman by Kedushin is not possible. Hey, Chilav, where are we going to, if let's say you have a star and had to write the Zman, where are we going to leave the star? When after he's Makadish, Limcha, Lagabi, Dida, if you leave the star by her, which is, she's a Basa Choso, Machala, Machale, she is going to erase it if she committed adultery after Kedushin, she'll erase it and she'll say the Kedushin happened later on. Limcha, Gabi, Dida, you leave it by the man, Zin, the Basa Choso, he. Maybe it's the case where he's married to his niece. Like by Gerish, and he's going to care, care for He's going to raise it up to save her. Say the cap, this should happen later. Lincha Gabi Adim, we leave it by the Adim. We just hear he lays who If the Adim are able to remember what day it was, let them come give Adis. If they can't remember, Zim in the Chazam Mikta Mikta, the Asu Mizdi, they're going to come, they're going to forget the date, and they're going to look in the star, and they'll go give testimony based on what they saw in the star. But Rahman Amar, Piyam, will speak of them. Adas has to come from memory. It can't come from reading something, from remembering it from a document. That's a puzzle. Adas. Yehachi begerish and nami neima hachi. Begerish and also we should say this that it's gonna they're gonna erase it. Mar says hachi hasam la tzola dida kaasi hachi lechova dida kaasi. There it's it's never gonna be a problem because you're coming to save uh, the woman. You're coming to save her. So therefore. You, in order by get, you have to make sure if you'd race the Zman, you'd make the Zman, uh, you'd make the Gerishin happen uh, a later time. Right? You wouldn't be able to make it, I'm sorry, you'd make the Gerishin happen an earlier time. So the Basa Chosa would be saved. Uh, here you're coming, Lechova Dida Kaasi, here um, there's more of a, a reason that she would erase it because you're going to have to erase it to make the Gerishin happen later. So there's more of a chance she's going to erase it. Right, as the was Gerishin, there's less of a chance you're gonna erase it. So, usually you just leave the Gerishin as it is.
because she's already married to the guy. So you assume that she is, uh, the gear should happen earlier. You, you would assume the gear should happen earlier. Uh, by Kedusha, you assume that it happened, it happened, we would assume it happened earlier, and really, you need it to happen later in order to save her. So, therefore, it's more of a reason she'd erase it. Hope you enjoy the Shir Shmuel. Say goodbye. Keep the beard, Shmuel. All right. Thank you. Bye.